I'm just thinking from the patient's point of view, he just goes to the website, yeah, centreformenshealth.co.uk, it's a mm. questionnaire, he just answers the simple questionnaire, that gives, well, him and, 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 and yourself uh, an idea of, is this patient suffering from testosterone deficiency? And let's say the patient does come to see doctors like yourself. I know there aren't mm. many across the country, but mm. what, what would happen then? Well, then again, we'd go over the history, see if we can find some cause for it, like excessive stress, too much alcohol, overweight can play a part. There's a whole range of factors, apart from obvious things like mumps and so on, uh, which can do lifelong damage to a man's testes. Uh, look into these factors, physically examine him, check the prostate's clear and okay, and then if that's appropriate and the uh, uh, doctor confirms the diagnosis, then you can start treatment with gels, are very common nowadays. Testosterone gel. Testosterone gel. Uh, or long-acting injections of testosterone, which uh, is another way of doing it, plus treating the erection problems with the usual things like Viagra, Cialis, Levitra, what I call the unholy trinity. Uh, <laughs> and um, they work very well with testosterone, what we call the dream team, yeah. working together. And you can cure and clear up over 90% of problems with erections.